ông quay cho ông chân đôi chân rẻ bạc cả một to cái chân lá cà này thì thì sạm lá cà sạm lá cà này bực nít ông chân rẻ nâng phơ sạm lá cà một to sẽ đập cây cam sạ xây đi chặt đốt mến tạm dễ phục vụ thật tốt vì thảo luận làm rình hay nơi rửa xíu nê chạp đâm vì mong mùi rửa xíu ông nhầm ra nâng phơ sạm lạc ca sẽ đập sẽ đẩy thay đi bỏ 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 tốt sọ bởi tình ý nâng phía sản lạc cắm rồi bỏ đâm mà đăng rập vì nì chung luôn bí rút đầy quạt ác an thà quạt bàn tự tù rốn nâng nâng rồi bỏ cầm bạch chìa thật bạch tay nó xung phía kì nâng xa tiền này chung chí điệp làm chi sắm là các lưu trí ở cái nhà chia sẻ hoang là người cam bị thành lập hiệp vật tâm miên ảo vật tâm miên phía kia nó bộc lộ để ở nhầm ra có hàng chưa nhà cho rùm được không cần nhầm là cả sắm là cả bậc này xong cướp lục vật thiên xâm lập sắm là cả nơi ngay ní cả là bình chí cắt xong có khuyên thà cướp phía kia tầng ở nơi đường cái đây ní miên vật tâm miên đại lái lục nôn chía miên vật tâm miên nợ bận tục không khôn thằng cào xa sắm là cả ní đại lục na sông lẹ băng sắt miền vật miền đại tổ bị bận tục sạm nà cả địch khất lẹ băng sắt đập bao chân chọc chọc nuôn chía ban bạc coi đo cả làm chi ruồi hỏi xạ xây đã trở một đo khay cam nơi thay ní cứ lục ri chạm đột mén tam rồi dẹp bỏ quan sao tua pi sa hạt ruồi america tam ca bên chợ pi này bị trái cái tết sao tua ban chun nằm nắng thẻ ca riệp chạm này bị trái cái tết sầm đập ca đập sạch khay cam nơi bề ní ban riệp chạm ruồi ruồi hỏi đi dạy xạ xây ก่อบานเตรียมครวนด้วยจิตใจสำหรับการดอสไคกามนิดใดดาวมันดังรถปะเวนีได้เติมหมกดอสไคกามเนยรถเซียนนี้คือเมียนปีรูปได้เมียนรถฮัสเนียมปีทีซีซีพีประมวลร้อยแปดสิบปีหนึ่งปีทีซีซีพีประมวลร้อยแปดสิบแปมสมองก้นลูกกระเทียนบ่าอกุนกันยาเจสีของบ้าเจียดบงที่เอาอย่างเดียว xong rồi lưu dùm nào xong rồi bỏ chung chọc chọc nguồn chia dùm bốn tấn ông nhầm rét tựa tù lịch khách xong lại bằng thức cho rùm xa mạng ca đại phát tốt nông bật tục xa mạng ca này rồi bỏ chung chọc chọc nguồn chia cho ngày thì mùi khai mê xa chân nằm bị bọn đọc nằm đại bình chạy thà đại còn biên bánh hạ thuộc của phiếp chư khá ba chư chư kê mà nài anh quý dụ bán mà nài phía chọn ở rộng bàn dũ nâng đâm bày miên là tập hiếp cho rùm xa mạng ca này thì ngày càng mốc ở miên bật มีแต่วิกาปีกระไดระบักลุ่นบานพรับอัมปีพอลปะปอลในการเหลี่ยมบองสุดนิท้าการเหลี่ยมบองสุดนี้มันอาจบอกสลายท้าจีการเหลี่ยมบองสุดระบักลุ่นของการกัดตะกระไดได้ยุติท้อหรือสุดของการจมต่อจนนังพอตั้งของการดับบังฮันหรือดับจุนตะลาการนี้กรุปปีเวลีในสัมนาการเลยรุกลุ่นเลยบานคืนกำหนดให้ปีนิดสกุลพิบจนจบเจ้าโนนชีได้เพื่อลายได้กรุปเป็นประจำกาปีนิดเพียบาทแทนตอมสกุลพิบจนจบเจ้าโนนชีในอวตก chuẩn cho chào nữa ở vào tổ có cho thằng này thì mua khay mê sa cho nam bị bọn đập rắm bàn cọt tổng quan thá sản phẩm sau cái phim lũ nôn chia miền nam cà rạ chư chẳng cây rầm rẫy mình ai chẳng quỳ dụ bán nâng đo là nút sát thá xôm ong dùm đây anh nhát ở lũ nôn chia cho rùm tam đan cây nhầm lá cá sạm lá cá bị vận tốc hàng cầm sa sạm mà cá đi ai lưu mưu thà đi nâng dùng tạm bật bình nhát này bị thiên bài sơn muối pram này bị thiên tây khăn ông ở vào tổ có ong dùm đây dùng rùm nâng anh nhát ở chuẩn cho chào nôn chia nơi bản to tam đan cây chầm nà ca sạm nà ca pi chầm ngái pi bản tục khung khuôn mũi thật nơi cầm xa sạm ca ni tam để dẹp bọc áo so tu sản phẩm dẹp pi sạm nà ca pin một ngày ni đại lục nôn chi lẹ bằng thức châu rùm nông cây chầm nà ca sạm nà ca đại to là nông bản tục sạm nà ca ni bằng cọ bay bọc lớp này so tu cho bọc bọn thọ tu sản phẩm chuyên chụp chọn nôn chi ai châu rùm nông tam đan cây chầm nà ca sạm nà ca pi chầm ngái pi bản tục khung khuôn mũi thật nơi cầm xa sạm ca ni nông dẹp pi này chầm nà ca sạm nà ca sản phẩm ngày ni Sau đây là Richard Dutman Tại lúc bạn rịp chôm khá luôn rồi hai rừng nữ I am ready, Mr. President Bác chôm rụi rõ hai lúc bởi thiên Bác ở quân là lúc Dutman Chia bà tổ tình ý ở nhập rẹp bà đo Vì tất cả chung tư Sạm mì tử bì nông múc Nông nàng đào mình đang rõ bởi ní Đang bày mình ở các bản tổ ca tăng xâm lột đánh đào Ở trong bộ hợp lục Sông chơi như lúc Sri 
สามีวีนมกรมนางเดิมมาดังรับรวินี้ว่าโดยเฉพาะองค์ยิมได้เราไปการจุนตัวกรมมีตัวบีกาเปียกระไดลูกคิวสมพรสมชื่นมาขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบคุณมากครับท่านประธานขอบ Lors de sa déposition devant cette chambre, votre consoeur Elisabeth Baker a évoqué les préparatifs en vue de votre voyage en de décembre 78 au Cambodge. Et voilà ce que elle a indiqué. Et là, je vais citer plutôt son ouvrage. En anglais, when the war was over, et en français, les larmes du Cambodge. Le RN, le passage que je vais citer se trouve à le RN 00 638 654 en français. Et en anglais, 00 238 115. C'est la page 402 euh, en anglais. Voilà euh, ce qu'elle dit à propos de ses préparatifs. Dodman et moi avions été informés de la situation critique du Cambodge avant notre arrivée. J'avais discuté avec des experts du département d'État, du ministère de la Défense et de la CIA à Washington. À Bangkok et à Pékin, j'avais rencontré des spécialistes politiques et militaires américains, français, canadiens, australiens et chinois. Aucun ne m'avait prédit une guerre à grande échelle entre le Vietnam et le Cambodge. Tout au plus, selon eux, les Vietnamiens pousseraient jusqu'au Mekong et s'y arrêteraient, satisfaits de contrôler la rive orientale du fleuve, avant de poursuivre vers la capitale au cours d'une offensive L'un des plus éminents experts américains, un vieil ami, m'assura à Bangkok que mes craintes au sujet des rumeurs de guerre et de ma propre sécurité étaient sans fondement. Ce sera du gâteau, conclut-il. Fin de citation. Ma première question et de savoir Nous si euh, vous vous souvenez, M. Dudman, si vous avez pris comme Mme Becker des précautions et euh, pris des informations sur la situation au Cambodge avant euh, de préparer votre voyage de 78. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez euh, si, euh, comme euh, il a été dit à Elisabeth Baker, euh, si on vous disait également qu'il n'y avait pas a priori à craindre d'offensive immédiate à propos de euh, ce conflit latent en cours entre le Cambodge et le Vietnam, est-ce que euh, 
toujours dans le cadre des préparatifs de ce voyage et surtout dans le cadre de votre travail sur la région et notamment sur le Vietnam. Est-ce que euh, vous avez eu à euh, effectuer des recherches sur euh, les questions frontalières entre le Vietnam et le Cambodge et notamment euh, les discussions relatives à la ligne Brésil I don't recall what uh, what research I may have done. Il y a je ne sais plus vous aviez évoqué vous avez eu l'occasion de réécouter les propos tenus par Pol Pot lors de votre entrevue hein, de 78, dans l'extrait qui a été euh, joué à l'audience hein, par mon confrère hein, de euh, Nyonchea, hein, je confirme que c'était bien hier, hein, Pol Pot évoque les volonté expansionniste du Vietnam et parle hein, également... Euh, du fait qu'il ne s'agit pas que d'un problème frontalier. Est-ce que vous vous souvenez de cette partie de cet entretien et est-ce que ça correspondait à vos connaissances de l'époque, si vous vous en souvenez, de, des volontés politiques du Vietnam est-ce que vous vous souvenez à l'époque, nous étions en pleine guerre froide, c'est aussi un point qui est évoqué euh, par Pol Pot dans ses propos, à savoir euh, un rapprochement entre le Vietnam et l'Union soviétique, est-ce que euh, cela rafraîchit votre mémoire par rapport aux événements de l'époque Dans votre rapport effectué en janvier 79, document E3-3290, et à l'ERN 00419-207, vous évoquez... Euh, la présence chinoise au Cambodge et voilà ce que vous dites je vais vous citer en anglais puisque nous n'avons pas de traduction française à l'attention des interprètes c'est euh, juste avant le paragraphe hein, Where are the rich Nowhere in our travels did we see The only sizable body of Cambodian troops are weapons, and the only signs we saw of Chinese assistance in the country were two MIGs flying about Phnom Penh one day and the line of 56 Chinese trucks driving north from Kong Pong Som where a Chinese fighter had discharged from the station. Monsieur Dudman, est-ce que euh, cette partie de votre rapport vous rafraîchit la mémoire et est-ce que vous vous souvenez avoir euh, bien vu euh, deux euh, MIG voler au-dessus de Phnom Penh Lors de sa déposition, et vous l'avez aussi évoqué brièvement, euh, vous avez évoqué, euh, pardon, Elisabeth Baker a évoqué la mort de Caldwell et les hypothèses qui ont euh, été formulées à l'époque. Toujours dans votre rapport E3-3290, voilà ce que vous écrivez. À nouveau, je vais passer 
à l'anglais, vous dites, vous évoquez les, ce qui a été dit par Tune Prasit. Prasit described the shooting as a political act to discredit, to discredit us in the world and to show that we cannot protect our friends. He said the terrorists knew that the visit of the first three Westerners to Cambodia was a significant one and that Cambodia's reputation in the world would be greatly damaged if they were assassinated. Only days later, that Cambodian regime would be driven in hiding by your Vietnamese assault. Là encore, même question, M. Dodman, est-ce que cette partie de votre rapport vous rafraîchit la mémoire Et est-ce que vous vous souvenez que Tchoum Prasit a évoqué dès le premier jour l'hypothèse d'une attaque vietnamienne I, I didn't understand your question. Je vous demande si cette partie de votre rapport vous rafraîchit la mémoire et si vous vous souvenez bien que Tchoum Prasit a évoqué l'hypothèse d'une attaque par le Vietnam, enfin d'une attaque terroriste par le Vietnam comme une euh, une thèse dès le premier jour de euh, cet assassinat. I really don't remember my thinking at the time. I, 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 well, I, what I wrote at the time was what I, what I knew then, or thought I knew, but I don't have any recollection of anything further. Dans le même rapport, vous avez également euh, évoqué les propos de Yang Sari, toujours un, au même ERN, donc 00419212. Je cite en anglais. Yang Sari said sadly that the, that the visit had been intended to present to the world the concrete situation in, this, in his country, but that the terrorist incident had cast a very dark cloud on this effort. The Cambodian government later attributed the terrorist act to Vietnam, its enemy in a current war, in which there was a temporary law at the time of our visit. Fin de citation. Même question, est-ce que euh, cela vous rappelle des souvenirs Ça correspond, j'ai bien compris, à, à vos, euh, votre rapport de l'époque et ce que vous aviez indiqué juste après les faits Dernier extrait que je veux hein, vous soumettre sur, euh, au sujet de votre rapport euh, de... 78, vous avez évoqué certaines euh, hypothèses, que, enfin, vous avez indiqué à l'audience, euh, euh, répondant aux questions de M. le coprocureur, qu'il y avait plusieurs euh, thèses à l'époque et qu'il y avait de la spéculation. Vous en souvenez, euh, vous vous souvenez que euh, beaucoup de, de, de bruits ont circulé à la suite de l'assassinat de Caldwell. Et voilà ce que vous avez indiqué à la fin de votre rapport sur l'hypothèse euh, d'une attaque fomentée par euh, le gouvernement Khmer Rouge lui-même. Voilà ce que vous avez indiqué. Finally, was there any possibility that the government could have arranged the attack? A dispatch from Hanoi later reported that Coldwell had recently turned against Cambodia and conjectured that the government may have wanted to prevent what they feared would be an adverse report. This seems out of the question. The Cambodian government had everything to lose from the incident. If 
some uncountable reason, the authorities had wanted us killed. They could have contrived an accident or ambushed to kill us all. And from lengthy conversation with Caldwell, up to a few hours of his death, I know that he remained fully sympathetic to the Cambodian Revolution. Première question, est-ce que euh, vous vous souvenez euh, de votre conclusion de l'époque et est-ce que vous confirmez euh, une Première question, est-ce que vous vous souvenez de, de, de cette conclusion Est-ce que c'est bien, est bien ce qui vous avait semblé en 78 que euh, cet, euh, cet attentat n'avait euh, aucun intérêt pour le, le gouvernement cambodgien I have read late just today, uh, again, what I wrote at the time, but I have no recollection of what led me to write that. I don't remember those circumstances. Bien. Je vous remercie de um, la patience dont vous avez preuve, M. Dodman, et je n'ai plus de questions à ce stade, M. le Président. អរលោកត្រីចក្រមេត្រមនោះទេបាទហើយសម្ណាការព្រឹកនេះដល់ពេលសម្រាក់ហើយដោយសារការធ្វើសម្ណាការនៅព្រឹកនេះបានចប់ម
My colleague, uh, Mr. Rayner, made uh, 10 points uh, to this uh, court uh, that emphasized uh, uh, the importance uh, of being able to rely uh, on uh, factual uh, information uh, from uh, these civil uh, parties. Uh, he emphasized uh, quote, that civil parties should be questioned on all issues of relevance, that evidence relating to suffering and the occurrence of the crimes was inextricably linked. He talked about how the civil parties were victims of the force movement, whose evidence would go to the heart of the trial. He noted that the defense uh, should be provided the opportunity to challenge that evidence. He stated, I quote, both the prosecution and defense have been proceeding uh, on the basis that full examination uh, would take place, uh, and, quote, quote, and he noted the duty of the chamber uh, to ascertain uh, the truth, which mandated that these civil parties testifying in the victim impact phase be treated the same as prior civil parties. In response, uh, this is what Mr. Pope Noon Che's counsel so, uh, said, uh, and I quote, uh, Mr. President, I don't think I would ever be saying this in a court of law, but I think I agree with all ten submissions from the prosecution. So we fully concur with the submissions of the prosecution. He was then followed by the Houston Pen defense, Mr. Burkin, who also concurred with our position. Let me quote him. Bringing people here for them to speak only about their harm suffered, without them explaining the reasons and experiences that led to this harm, seems unusual to me and incongruous in such a trial. It's difficult to distinguish the origin of the factual aspects of the harm. From the harm that it's self. It seems to me that it is normal that these people come next week that aspects linked to harm slide into some things that are factual. We will manage as we can each situation in order to try to examine them. The next day, on the 21st of May, Again, at the end of the day, this is uh, document, the transcript for the 21st of May, 2013, E1, slash 194.1, page 119 in English. The trial chamber issued its ruling on this issue, stating, I quote, there has been a mutual consent amongst all parties, and the chamber decides that the parties may question the civil parties on relevant factual issues subject to the time limitations already announced. So, when we started the victim impact proceedings, everyone in this court knew that they would be examined not just on harm, uh, but on the relevant facts. That is why all the parties asked questions on that, and that is why this chamber cited that evidence in its judgment. Um, it's very unfortunate to me uh, that these arguments were put to the court yesterday. Um, it's not an isolated incident in the appeal brief that was filed by the Ming Chae team. And on a going forward basis, I might suggest that the Ming Chae team wishes to make motions to this court. Um, it file a motion and not simply attach portions of an appeal brief um, which are being litigated before the Supreme Court. Uh, we take issue with many, many characterizations like this which misstate what, what has happened before this Court. Uh, in any event, it's important that the record be clear um, that in the past trial, uh, this Court announced very clearly that these uh, civil parties would be examined on factual issues, and the same should happen uh, today in the start. Thank you. Uh, one more question. Uh, the Claudia Fenn. 
Perhaps it's easier if I add something and then you can answer to both. In this context, uh, I would like to refer to a decision the Nunchia team has referred to in their repeals brief, and that's E267-3 from 2nd of May 2013. So my guess is that Yeah, I just wanted to add that there was a decision in 2017 from 2nd May 2013 dealing with the issue at hand, and I guess it was probably the basis for the debate in court a couple of days later. It was also referenced by the Nunchia defense in the, in the appeal, um, and specifically Patch 9 of this decision to deal with all the um, issues raised yesterday by the Nunchia defense. It clearly says that cross-examination will be allowed. And it also clearly in paragraph 21 says how generally, generally how the trial chamber will deal with civil party statements, including defense statements, on trial level. The reason I didn't mention it yesterday is because since it was mentioned in the appeal, I thought it was obvious, and the only thing I tried to do is highlight what I thought was probably a misquote of another decision. But just to add to the arguments, thank you. Uh, thank you, Judge Fenz. Um, and in reaction to what the Deputy Co-Prosecutor just said, um, um, of course, yesterday I revisited our appeal brief, and I also revisited the decision of the trial judge in this respect. Um, and, um, it seems to me we have a completely different interpretation as to the ruling on this matter of penalty. Um, to us, to me, it seems clear there's a distinction between testimony given uh, by witnesses or civil partners in the morning, uh, while sitting there and giving uh, testimony to the facts and the phenomenon of civil impact um, obviously, if um, a civil party talks about the suffering, uh, he or she would relate to uh, some underlying facts. Um, however, the whole idea of the distinction also made by the trial chamber is that it is, in, in essence, no evidence, uh, evidence that will not be used uh, against the accused uh, ultimately in his judgment. That's how uh, we understood it then, and that's how we still understand the decision. Um, you've seen in our appeal brief that we've quoted uh, 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 your decision, um, and uh, the mere fact that it is only uh, 10 minutes' time that was allotted to us to ask some questions to the civil party uh, giving civil impact testimony is one element that confirms uh, our interpretation and understanding. Uh, the fact, as mentioned yesterday, uh, that you asked uh, the defense's permission to continue while the Nunchia was absent because of sickness. Confirms uh, this interpretation. Um, we have been always acting on the basis of um, uh, a fundamental difference in suffering uh, um, testimony on the one hand and real testimony to the evidence on the other. At the time, and that is in, res in re response no, no. to uh, Deputy Co-Prosecutor uh, uh, no, 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 At the time, of course, we were fully agreeing with 
nhưng mà anh chưa sắp đến sớm rồi chỉ mới khi lên đại sa trại dừng thật dừng quay tại tụt bàn học cát mà thế đâm bắt tập thang là bắt chết sẽ đánh cái thang lục miền nẹp đập đi tí đâm bay su su bị bắn to tụt tiếc bắn thang A difference between, on the one hand, a civil party coming in and then 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 a civil The defense team are lawyers. We meet to make a big day. We see things wrongly. 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 Alternative are proposed to be the equal time to ask questions and ask questions. That's how it should be. 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 ដោយសម្រងចេញពីសាលាមិនដឹងសាទុកនេះអ៊ីសពីរៀនស៊ីដើម្បីវិជាយមូលហេតុនៃការធ្វើតោកសាវនាការធ្វើតោកឲ្យ
les faits et les souffrances, puisqu'il faut un minimum que euh, la partie civile évoque les faits, mais des faits qui lui sont propres et des faits qui doivent être examinés par la Chambre en, bu, en vue de la demande de réparation qui intervient dans un deuxième temps, puisque nous sommes d'accord, il ne peut y avoir de demande de réparation que s'il y a une culpabilité qui est prononcée. Dans ces conditions, c'est euh, le sens de la clarification aujourd'hui, puisque nous aussi, nous avons noté au paragraphe 30, il me semble, de notre mémoire d'appel, euh, qu'il y avait eu une utilisation massive des euh, déclarations des partis civils qui étaient censés avoir très simplement à la demande de réparation morale et collective et qui ont été utilisés comme des éléments de preuve à charge. Voilà la clarification que nous demandons aujourd'hui, étant précisé, encore une fois, que nous avons toujours essayé de faire preuve de euh, clairvoyance euh, dans euh, les questions que nous posons et que nous avons l'intention de continuer à faire ceci. Maintenant, si il y a des éléments nouveaux, et encore une fois, je précise que éléments nouveaux pour nous, ce n'est pas toujours simple lorsque nous n'avons que des éléments ténus euh, relatifs aux parties civiles avant qu'elles viennent de déposer. Donc, ce n'est que à la vue et à l'audition de la déposition de ces parties civiles que nous saurons si nous devons avoir besoin de plus de temps pour les contre-interroger. I'll, I'll be very brief. Um, what we just heard is, is revisionist history. Uh, read the transcript from the 20th of May 2013. There is no ambiguity. Uh, there is no room at all for Mr. Kope and the defense to suggest that they were unaware of the purpose of the victim impact civil parties. It could not be clear. The exact issue we were discussing was the extent to which the civil parties heard in victim impact would be testified about factual information and whether that could be used. That was the issue. Read the 10 points for Mr. Rayner, read the responses from the defense counsel. This is crystal clear. This is an issue that they have made up after the judgment, after losing. It is as simple as that. Mr. Rayner, I'll come to you. ពីពេលហើយសម្ញញ្ញកនិយាយហើយថ្ងៃនេះនិយាយដោយមិនបានគ្រូងទុកជាមុនទៀតផងហើយអ្វីដែលបានលើកឡើងនេះអង្គចម